Welcome back to this channel for practice problems for actuarial exams. My name is Krzysztof Bostoszewski. You can find information about me at smarturl.it forward slash Jedi. My advice on how to pass actuarial exams is at smarturl.it forward slash pass. This video channel is at smarturl.it forward slash pass actuarial exams. Here you have information about online seminars and study manuals for exams PFM, IFM, and LTEM that I offer. I direct the actuarial program at Illinois State University. You can find information about it at smarturl.it forward slash actuary. If you would like to offer a tax-deductible donation to support our students, please go to smarturl.it forward slash help ISU actuary. Here's a problem for today, for exam LTEM. You are given that the force, uh, the force of mortality is constant and equal to 0 0.01 and a double dot x colon angle 5 is 4.543 as well as the interest rate is 4%. Consider a 5 year deferred whole life annuity due on x. Let s be the random sum of all the annuity payments. Find the probability that s is more than um, the cost of um, the actual present value of a 5 year deferred life annuity on uh, x life annuity due on x, x years old. Well, we know that a double dot x is equal to 1 plus i over q plus i and the constant force, so that's 1.04 over um, the probability of survival of 1 year is e to the minus 0 0.01, so probability of dying in 1 year is 1 minus e to the minus 0 0.01 and plus 0 0.04, and that's approximately 20.820715. And the deferred um, um, annuity actual present value is a double dot uh, x minus a double dot x colon angle 5. So it's 20.820715 uh, minus 4.543 that's given in the problem, and that's 16.277515 approximately. Since s is an integer, s must be at least 17 in order to be greater than. 16.2777515. Thus, 17 payments must be made. Since payments are made at times 5, 6, 7, and so on, up to 5 plus 17, which is 22, the insured must survive to time 22, which is the end of year 21, so the insured must survive 21 complete years. Because the insured does not have to survive the 22nd year, just be alive at the beginning of it, and he or she is there by surviving 21 years. The property of that survival of 21 years is 21px, which is e to the minus 21 times 0 0.01, because we have constant force of mortality of 0 0.01, and that's approximately 0 0.81058425. Um, please remember this is copyrighted material. The problem is written by me and solution is mine. All rights reserved through production and hall are in part without express written permission from the author is strictly prohibited. 